11.55, almost midnight. Enough time for one more story. One more story before 12, just to keep us warm. Five minutes be the 21st of April. 100 years ago, on the 21st of April, out in the waters around Spivey Point, a small clipper ship drew toward land. Suddenly, out of the night, the fog rolled in. For a moment, it seemed nothing. The foot ahead of them, and they saw a light. By God, it was a fire burning on the shore, strong enough to penetrate the swirling mist. They steered a course toward the light. But it was a campfire like this one. The ship crashed against the rocks. The hole sheared in two. Moth snapped like a twig. The wreckage sank with all the men aboard. At the bottom of the sea lay the Elizabeth Dane. The crew, their lungs filled with salt water, their eyes open, staring to the darkness. And above, as suddenly as it had come, the fog lifted, receded back across the ocean, never came again. But it is told by the fishermen and their fathers and grandfathers and when the fog returns to Antonio Bay, the men at the bottom of the sea, out in the water by Spivey Point, will rise up and search for the campfire and lead them to their dark, icy death. Twelve o'clock. 21st of April.